What I enjoy about the museum is having people come in and connect with different memories. And it, it's an emotional time that is kind of enjoyable to, to see and to uh, be part of. There's something truly artistic and beautiful about the craftsmanship that goes into those classic boats. And it's something that very few people are going to be able to ever experience in person. We have lots of objects here, but probably one of the most compelling things is some of the gossip that surrounds the items and creates a story. Everyone loves to hear a good story, and here's a compelling one for you. The, the essence of why we're here it goes back again, I believe, to capturing those memories and those times when we were at the lake probably 50, 75 uh, years ago, 40 years ago, maybe 20 years ago for some younger people because those were some neat times. So they can come here, they, they can identify boats, they can look at the resorts, they can, they can just connect with the kind of culture that they grew up with. And you know, when they leave, uh, they, they have a smile on their face and the first thing they say when they come into this museum is, wow. The founders were a group of people who loved wooden boats and wanted to share their love of them and of the lakes with each other and ultimately with the public. So they started small and they very quickly built this museum up to be what it is today, which is a reflection not just of the wooden boat culture, but of really the whole culture of lake life. Well, the museum is a, an important part of the community. Uh, it provides for not only the residents here, but the people that come and visit. The museum is in the position to provide some educational activities for children. And become a central figure in our community and provide more opportunities for gathering and then provide more support for the museum. We expanded our campus to the east. We purchased this cinder block building from the city, so we expanded our campus to the west. We agreed on a lease to the gardens property from the city, so we expanded it to the north. This organization has grown so much in the last 10 years. We're part of the community. Uh, this place really has helped to reposition the north end of Alexandria into, uh, I think, the go-to place in this community. I'd hope that We've shown you a little bit about the museum that is enough to spark your interest to come down and, and participate in what we have here. Maybe you have cultural materials that belong in the public eye, and we would love to hear your stories as well.